Geeks, Tim with MajorGeeks.com, and today we're going to take a look at a problem when you can't see other computers on your network. A couple of things to take note before we begin. These are very easy fixes. Note number one, there are two possibilities here. Step number one assumes that you're on a Windows computer trying to look at a Windows computer. Step number two assumes that you're on a Windows computer trying to look at, let's say, a Linux or a Mac computer. One more quick note. The function discovery service, which we're going to play with, is what the computer does when it tells other computers that it's there in broadcast. So you don't want to run this on your computer if you can't see another computer, but instead you want to go to the computer that you can't see and run it on that, okay? So let's press the Windows key plus R and type in services.msc, and that will bring up all your running services. What we're looking for here when it comes up is to go alphabetical, scroll down to the Fs, EF and we want to find let me move this over so you can see it okay function discovery provider host now you're probably looking at stopped and manual possibly regardless if it's running go ahead and click stop so if you're looking right here and it says it's running stop it then come up here and change it to automatic delayed start click on apply click on OK reboot and now go back to your other computer and see if you can see this computer. Don't forget to reboot. And really that's it for the computer that you can't see on Windows. It's one of the most common fixes known out there. So now that we've done that, let's take a look at when you have a computer on your network you can't see that's a Linux or a Mac. Not much different here. Again, I'll link to this article, but you can see we explain here that Linux, for example, uses server message block, SMB. Windows 10 might have it off, so the problem this time will be on your computer, not their computer, but the fact that you need to turn SMB on. So as you can see here, we want to press the Windows key plus S for searching. If you use Cortana, you can use that. Start typing in turn Windows, that's about as far as you got to get. Turn Windows features on or off, click on it. As this comes up, once again, everything is alphabetical. We are going to scroll on down as explained right here to find the SMB 1.0 CIFS file sharing support. There's two of them there, I believe, that sounds similar. Right there, one of them is longer. Expand that little plus sign right here. And now you can see SMB 1.0 client. Go ahead and click on the client, click on OK. Windows is gonna do a few things in the background. Gosh only knows what. And when it's done, it will prompt you to reboot. If for any reason it does not prompt you to reboot, please go ahead and reboot anyway. That way you should now be able to see Linux or Mac computers because you have the server message block service on. There you go. So you just click on restart now. Bada bing, bada boom. Should work. Hey, like to hear from you. Leave a comment if we helped you out. Click subscribe, blah, blah, blah. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.